Good afternoon, everyone. Today I would like to talk about what appears to be the first negative polarity invisible sunspot that seems to be at 1500 Gauss. If this is indeed true, the sun is now shutting down and the beginning of the new minimum has verifiably started. What appeared on the sun on December 15th to the north and east of sunspot group 2239 was an anomaly on the sun which can only be described as an invisible sunspot. Researchers Livingston and Penn as well as Zeeman theorized that when magnetic fields in the sunspots are 1500 Gauss or weaker that they will become invisible to the naked eye. Now the sunspot is still there and as you can see in the next image here there is negative polarity in the magnetogram. It was not an artifact from the lens or some type of flare discoloration. It actually shows negative polarity meaning that the sunspot is not actually strong enough for the magnetic field lines to wrap around to give it that darker color than the surface itself. An invisible sunspot, if you will. Now Livingston and Penn have been compiling data since, let's say, 1993. As you can see, the downtrend there was predicted 2015 to decrease to around 1800 or so Gauss. But what it appears right now is that we've actually gone down to 1500 and the sunspots are behaving exactly as they thought and theorized would happen. Now how can you actually measure the magnetism inside a sunspot? Well, Zeeman discovered that looking at spectral lines emitted by iron atoms, you can determine the magnetic strength within a sunspot. Now all three of these people have theorized below 1500 that the sunspots will disappear. This is exactly what just happened, which means that the plasma fields on the sun itself are decreasing and these magnetic breakthroughs, if you will, that cause the sunspots are in a very, very, very low energy state right now. If the sun is shutting down during the Maunder Minimum, sunspots were absent from the sun for 30 years. If we would have had the modern satellites in the 1640s, we would have seen the negative polarity just not visible to the naked eye. This is exactly what's starting to happen right now. And on a lighter note, I'll leave you with an Arctic sea ice concentration comparison. The left side is December 11, 2007. The right side December 11, 2014. As you can see, the sea ice has come back and it actually is more dense, as well as the periphery has extended outward. And as cyclical patterns go, do you notice the pattern on this chart here going back a thousand years? Stop and take a look at that. Put it together with extreme fluctuations in temperature these last couple of winters into record-breaking cold, record-breaking snow, and now we have this apparent 1500 Gauss invisible sunspot appear out of nowhere. Thanks for watching. Hope you got something out of the video useful and helpful. Things are moving and changing around us so quickly right now. You're going to need to take care of yourselves. The governments will not help. They are actually hindering what could be preparation time right now going forward with this silliness of CO2 causing heating on our planet. When all the signs are here right now, shouting, screaming that we are going into a cool period.